I'm not playing with you. Lay down. Ugh. Dogs. I swear. Make sure that all of this shiz is working. Why is there a dashboard, but I cannot see my own stream? The fuck? Oh. That face when I can't see my own chat. Dog, I am not playing with you. I don't care how many times you try, I'm not. It's just, it's not gonna happen. Meh. Good enough. I don't know if we're live or not. I'm just gonna assume we are. Just cause why not? Up oh, there we go. Yeah, now we are. Really? Sweet, we'll listen to a yet another Geico commercial. Just because we didn't just recently. Thanks, Geico and uh, Twitch. Gotta pay the bills somehow, I suppose. Oh yeah, I forgot that we were on like the last one. <laughs> Cry Wolf. Ah, uh, yeah. Oh yeah, I forgot that we were on, like, the last one. Yeah, sweet. Microphone's good. <laughs> okay, so... It's been a hella long time since I played this game. Like, far, far too long. I mean, your eyes and the teeth? You're not really supposed to do that, are you? Eh. Hey. Oh, yeah, I forgot I didn't kill him. Oh yeah, if they take the bow off, they die. I forgot about that. Oh hey. No. Holly's sister. Lily. The fuck? Do you even give a shit about us? The strays? That's why you can't tell me anything. It's the ribbon, isn't it? Well, she ain't gonna We're tell you. The tree. No! We're not burning the tree, Snow. Hey, you're not really gonna send me to the farm, are you? I might. I don't know. Snow will come around. She's just... You know, the crane thing hit her hard, and she doesn't really know who her friends are right now. Ayo. <laughs> don't be a bitch. You'll be aight. This time was no joke. Eat as many metal shellings as you see fit, but take just one more silver round near your heart, and the only place I'll be visiting you is the morgue. Bigby, <laughs> wait. When you get the crooked Mr. Bacon. Man, make sure you bring him back alive. Oh, he shit, I forgot. Shit went down when last time. Seat, Sheriff? 
We have a great deal to discuss. Fuck. That intro, boys. It's been way too long. <laughs> Hey, the wolf among us. Far too long since I played this game. Mr. Bacon is not the waifu. when your dog is staring at you menacingly. Episode 5, Cry Wolf. You've come a long way. <laughs> you must be tired. Nice place correct, you got. You haven't had a lot of rest recently. Please, Sheriff, relax for a moment, will you? Do you want a drink? Something to eat? Vivian makes a very nice, very... It's elegant. Really, a carpaccio... I'm here for it's one reason. Sirloin. I'm here for one reason, and it's not to eat your fucking food. Ooh. Really? Yeah. What do you think you're doing? He's gonna. Mr. Wolf is our guest, and I have every intention of cooperating. So don't waste the silver. Sit down, Jersey. I'll take that gun and shove well, it right Jerry, up your ass. For the sake of transparency, why don't you tell us why you're here? It would help settle everyone's nerves. You tried to kill me. You're destroying this town. You killed those women. Yeah, fuck destroying it. Destroying this town. You've been doing it for ages. Destroying this town? Yes. What on earth do you mean? What the hell do you think I mean? Slavery? Kidnapping? Extortion? Murder? What would you call the wholesale corruption of Fable Town? I would call it the baseless accusation of a desperate sheriff. How are you certain this isn't some conspiracy against me? I'm a well-connected man. Would well, that money. you can't play me. Would you like to take their shots at me? You're right that there's a conspiracy. But you're the one behind it. I have no need for treachery, Bigby. I do everything right out in the open. But I can understand you, the confusion. And I'm truly sorry about the trouble all this has caused you. And I hope you believe me when I say, Sheriff, that I sincerely mean to make it up to you. The recent murders that have gotten such attention as of late, I don't relish telling you that they were perpetrated by an employee of mine. It's a very unfortunate bit of business, but... I promise you that the matter will be dealt with internally. I just want to settle the issue for you and to assure you that it's over with. You really do. I know who did it. Who did it? Yeah, fuck it. Who did it? An unfortunate bit of business. You're going to tell me right now who killed him. Sheriff, I have complete respect for you and your job. I hope you know that. But I simply can't divulge that information. You really shouldn't worry yourself. As I said, I've got this under control. No, do you though? I'm gonna deal with it right now. Yeah, right. What do you think this is? Some kind of negotiation? <laughs> the man said he'd take care of it. So why don't you take the hint and get out? I'm the law here, not you. Now tell me who did it. You think I'm scared of you? Did you see what I did to your brother? <laughs> You're nothing more That's than enough. A I was hoping it wouldn't come to this. I could have murked your brother, my dude. Preserving our alliance. If you have to know, it was Georgie. <laughs> Fucking knew it. However, like I said, I'll be handling the matter if you don't mind. Georgie, you got what you wanted, so just sit down now. <laughs> Pot him out the window. Hike. Yeah, I killed him, so what? 
You should have just kept your nose where it fucking belonged. Why'd you do it? Why kill them? Does it matter? Look, the fact is... George here misinterpreted one of my instructions. Misinterpreted? And I want to make things right. So... let's work something hmm. out. What's there to work out? I'm protected, aren't I? Your protection has limits. And I think you've far exceeded yours. But you could murder someone in cold blood like that. You fucking asked me to do this! And then you attempt me to, to blame him. me for it. You will be silent while we discuss oh, what shit. to do with you. This is right, bollocks, sis. You're just gonna let him do this? Yeah. Very much. So what do you Good say, fuck, nerd. Can we discuss terms? Sure. You can have Georgie. Consider it a gift. Ensuring our continued cooperation. All okay, right. fuck it, let's, let's talk. talk. You can't just hand me over! What like, he just did. Shit? He you literally just did. For, us. for minor infractions, not murder. Just go with him, Georgie. You're gonna sink us all. What's wrong with you people? You're really gonna sell him out just like you that? You think I'd give a fuck if I'm the one who the shit do you think you fuckers are the fuck out of here? Do Please, one of them it, shoot him. But I think it's best if you leave now. There's no way I'm going with him. Are you kidding me? Things are about to get unpleasant, and I would rather you weren't here to watch. You can go join that whore at the bottom of the lake for all I give a shit. Kind of see. But he's not taking me anywhere. <laughs> I'll roll over on the lot of you before I let that shit happen. What are you saying? Yeah, what the fuck? Fuck it. Let's go, Georgie. Get the fuck away from me. He's the one you fucking want. This could have gone so well. It could have. But you just had to complicate things. To speak the truth, I've never been a very good mediator. Why negotiate when you can just decide? Oh, hey! <laughs> Did I miss anything good? Well, look at you all fixed up. <laughs> Oh, hey. And it was at this moment I continuously fucked them all up. And Take my this. game broke. JK. Oh, hey. Wow, these quick time events are really fucking lagging. You're done, Wolf. Come on. We're pretty much done here. Uh, well, fuck you. I'd like to say it was nice knowing you, but I'll be glad to see your insides turned out. God damn, why the fuck are these quick time events so broken? <laughs> Just fucking stabbed your friend. Get fucked, nerd. Oh shit. <laughs> it was at this moment that I gave about zero fucks. Yes! Yes! Get fucked, nerd! You all just got fucked up by one kid. Get, 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 get f -f fucked. One guy. Achievement, beginning of the end. Ah, completed chapter one of episode five. Ooh, stifle greed. Ooh, shit. I know. No. Oh, no way. Big P don't give a fuck. <laughs> skirp, 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 skirp. Oh god. 
Oh shit. He's <laughs> got fucking hit by a car. That's awesome. Gar. Says the wolf. <laughs> oh shit, I hit the wrong thing. Fuck, what was that? What the fuck do you think it is, mate? Well, fuck this bitch. Now fuck this bitch. Hey. Take him off. I can't. Don't worry, I got this. Vicky's he's like, this is some fucking bullshit. Let's go. Are you sure? Do it. He's not moving. Keep going. Oh god. Convenient clothes can be inconvenient. Good shank nerd. That wolf shrank yet in a right. Well, there ain't fucking nothing in there, so... YOLO! Keep hitting my mic. <laughs> Another achievement. Let's go. Come on! We can't stay here! Uh, uh, hang on! I need a minute! Okay. All right, continuing on. How did it get this? Oh, 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 oh. Don't worry. Don't blow your mic. Shit. Hello, Big B. I hoped you'd come to your senses. <laughs> oh. Crooked man's the one you want. But of course, you're too much of an idiot to see that. Or maybe you just like me too much to let me go. That it, Sheriff? I'm gonna rip you to fucking pieces. <sighs> go on, then. Please, oh, Sheriff. I want to. Haven't you done enough? Look at him. He's dying. Vivian, you don't know what you're doing. Get out of the way. Now. No. It isn't his fault. He's a murderer. Faith and Lily, he's the reason they're dead. Look, I know he made a few mistakes. We a all few? have. A few? What? He made sure they couldn't talk with those damn ribbons, and then he killed them. You're wearing one yourself. Doesn't that bother you even a little, knowing that man of murdered- Of course it does. Those girls- oh, So it's all my fucking fault, then. I you didn't fucking... mean- You fucking- You're gonna throw me to the fucking wolf, too? You know I didn't have a goddamn choice. What the fuck? Ugh. I did what I had to! You can't fucking blame me for that! 
Look. Why'd you do it then, huh? If it's not your fault, then what the fuck happened? <sighs> nice tits. <laughs> Look, Faith and the others tried to pull a run on us. And as you can imagine, the crooked man wasn't too thrilled. But of course, the big boss didn't want to get his fucking hands dirty. <laughs> so he told me to take care of it. You think I don't know what that means? Either I do what he says or I'm the one getting dealt with. Uh -oh. So I fucking killed him. And I'd do it again. Because it's not my fault. The crooked man gave the order. He told me to kill them. And then he fucking sold me out. You're still the one who pulled the trigger. True. Nobody held your hand and made you go through with it. Ryan, believe what you want. I can tell you've made up your mind. Doesn't matter if it's fucking true or not. Go ahead and kill me then. But it won't bring back Lily or Faith. It won't free your friend Narissa. And I'm just the sap taking the fall for the whole thing. It must be so easy being you. Just come in here and blame me for all this shit. Job's done, right? George is the bad guy. It's all his fucking fault. Oh, oh, oh. But what was I supposed to do? You don't know what it's like, Bigby. How could you know? Stop complaining and take responsibility for what you did. You murdered Faith and Lily. You put those fucking ribbons around their necks. You had the power to let him go, but you chose not to. You don't know what the fuck you're talking about. If I freed them... What would you have me do? Kill her? Georgie, don't. It was them or Vivian. So you tell me, if Free and Lily meant she had to die... Do you still think I had a fucking choice? What are you doing? Wait, how is she involved in all this? This is the original. The girl with the ribbon. I'm sure you've heard the stories. Couldn't take it off. Couldn't talk about it. She used her little purple ribbon to make more of them. To keep more. our girls quiet. To ensure absolute discretion. You promised you wouldn't. All that magic is connected to this little thing. You remove hers, and the spell's broken. They're all free. But you know what happens to her? The same thing that happened to Faith. So don't you come in here and tell me I fucked up. What the hell, Georgie? We were supposed to look out for each other. I trusted you. You can't fucking blame me. You're not innocent here either. Wait, those were your ribbons? You're in on this? I thought you cared about them. I do. Of course I do. You have to understand. Then why'd you do it then, Mo? Nobody was supposed to die. When we built this place, it it was just a stupid idea, a gimmick. Discretion is our guarantee. That's how it started, anyway. This was supposed to be our place. We were going to be in charge for once, and nobody would try to control us or use us. That was the point. And the crooked man showed up, and everything just turned to shit. So, do you get it now? Why I couldn't just... If you still think it's so fucking simple, then you do it. Go right ahead. Kill her then. What are you doing? Break the Pull spell. her ribbon. Save the fucking day. Stop it. I told you. Sometimes all your options are shit. I kind of want to pull her ribbon. this game, Georgie. I won't kill her. Don't talk about me like I'm not even here. Please. You think this is hard <laughs> for you? You know, My second thought, I kind of want to go back. It's a fucking burden on your pull. conscience. Don't I get a say? It's no. my life. Like it was either of yours to give up in the first place. I wasn't really- Vivian, I'm not gonna kill you. I know that. Wait. I'm sick of everyone thinking that they can just- <laughs> Oh shit. Do what they want with my life. I thought it would be different Assisted here. suicide. But Assisted suicide. Vivian, I didn't mean- Do you think I wanted to be this person? What I did to Faith and Lily? To all of them. Vivian, wait. I... Every day I have to look Gwen and Hans in the eye and pretend I don't care. I have to forget what I've done to them, what I took away from them. No. I look at Narissa and I hate myself. Vivian. I can't pretend anymore. What are you doing? Vivian, don't. No. Oh. Oh. Good Vivian, time, no! Oh shit, Fuck. what up? No, 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 no! Why'd you have to do that, Vivian? Vivian! Are you happy now? Is this what you wanted? Oh, shit. Vivian, I didn't fucking mean it. I was just... <sighs> oh. 
Pie. <laughs> Get fucked, Vivian. Oh, fuck! Get up. Get up! Don't think so, Bigby. I'm gonna die here. I think we both know that. Just make sure you give the crooked man the same treatment when you find him. Well, where do really I find fuck him? him up for me, all right? He's gonna have it worse. Don't worry. Good. Old foundry by the river, all right? Shepherd Metalworks. He'll be there. Fucking asshole. You wanna finish me off now? Or do you plan to kick me around a little first? Rip my limbs off one by one? That's what you want to do, right? That's nah. not who I am. Sure it's not. No more games, all right. We both know how this ends. <laughs> <laughs> Those noises, though. I know nah. what I did. I'll leave you to die. It's A-OK. -okay. <laughs> Sad. Just gonna leave me here. You'll have plenty of time to think about what you've done. <laughs> Savage. Piece of shit. Dude, Adonius. Lol. They'll be fine. Where do we get to see snow again? I want to see snow. Snow or we dry it. Shepherd Metalworks. We legit just took a taxi to the villain's place without anybody else to help us. We're f f f There, hello. Of course. Broke the lock on it. It's funny. Snoomy live. When your cat's tripping balls, all right. So, this is where they've been sending these. Ooh. This is the best safety device is a careful worker. No shit. Oh, that's not eerie at all. My cat's tripping balls. Big B wolf. The big bad wolf. You used oh. to be something. Used to be. Bitch, I still is. It's now, ya boy. 
fuck? They used to fear you. They'd hide anywhere their small shivering bodies would fit. Okay. Bleach. It's the answer. Ooh, what's in here? God, the mechanic, walking mechanic in this game is so broken. Well, that's how they make the silver bullets. But I have some business to attend to. I leave you in the capable hands of my associate. Come find me when you finish, dear. Don't worry. This won't take long. Get out of my way now. Don't make this worse. Aw, he doesn't want to play. I'm sure you'll persuade him. <laughs> Cut this shit out! Didn't your mother ever teach you manners? Huh. <laughs> Oh, no, but she will learn some. Whatever breeze drifted through town. Oh, come on. Is that the best you can do? This bitch keeps disappearing. I don't like this room. This is just silver back there. That's not a good thing. Is that noise? This might have been a mistake, just because that means I'm more susceptible to be pushed into one of those things, and/or fall. Fuck are we all the way the fuck up here? Well that was my bad and I hit X instead of B. Oops. We'll be A okay, don't worry about it. Next time. Oh come on, I even hit X that time. God damn it. These quick, these quick time Come events are too quick. Me. What the fuck is that? What the hell? Well, aren't you just a beautiful son of a bitch? Big bad wolf horses bloody me. Come on, Stan, let's go. Ooh, we're moving now. This is some bullshit. Just Allahu Akbar off the top of it, just cause why not? It's a wolf. Okay, seriously, what is that noise? What the hell? Rawr. <laughs> 
Oh, this is cool. We're gonna be A-OK, -okay, boys. Let's go. Got this. It's a wolf. Oh god. We're getting shanked. We're being shanked. Prison shanks. Prison shanks. Oh. <laughs> he isn't playing anymore. We are not playing anymore. This is no longer playtime. <laughs> this is awesome. Can't stop, won't stop. <laughs> Come at me. <laughs> We're just gonna bite it in half. Yep. <laughs> Jesus! How many are there? They're everywhere. Are we gonna just spit fire? We're about to drop our mixtape. So cold, we be inches away. <laughs> Found you. Oh, what the hell? <laughs> this, ladies and gentlemen, is why you do not fuck with wolf. <sighs> this can only end badly for us because we're nude and exposed. Seriously, convenient clothes keep on being convenient. Achievement? A silver bullet. Well, that can be good. Naked. Hello, oh, hey. Bigby. You look tired. Give me one good reason not to rip you apart right now. This gun holds six rounds of sp I won't miss next time. Before you I... do anything with me, I thought I should point out a few things. Snow White wants you to bring me back to the woodlands, doesn't she? And that's what I want. That's right. But what happens to you once you get there is a different story. I'm not quite finished. You will bring me back alive. Look, all I ask for is the chance to speak for myself in front of the community. And I'm well, sure Miss White work. would agree that I should be given a fair trial. Can we at least agree on that? I will have a trial. Are we clear? You need to tell me right now. We're not going anywhere until I get some answers from you. If you want answers, you're going to have to cooperate with me. 
Look, this is how much no I give a fuck. To be at each other's throats here. That's funny, coming from a guy pointing a gun at my head. This is just a precaution. I'm sure you understand. I'm Seeing how I just wrecked your best person? I yes. Kill those women. And I think you know that. All I'm asking for is a chance to explain <laughs> my side of the story. Maybe you didn't carry it out. But I don't think Georgie was lying when he said you ordered their deaths. Georgie would have said yeah. anything to save himself. We both know that. That's I'm not true. Oh not a killer. There's still a lot you have to answer for. And I will. As long as you agree to my terms. Because I'm not saying another word until I'm brought before the community. I don't mean sure. to that, But just so we're clear. If you change your mind and decide to do something stupid, you won't get your answers. But you will have a difficult time explaining yourself to Miss White and the rest of us. You got a haircut. Where is he trying to go? That's what I'm worried about. And I worry you're not thinking The gun was blank. There's nothing in it. What do you really care about here? Where this case is concerned, I mean. Do you really want the truth? Or do you just want to look like the hero? Don't answer. Two very different things. You're smart, I'll admit that. So what I just don't understand is why you're here. I mean, you want to catch your killer, right? Yes, that would be you. Georgie. He's dead, isn't he? Yeah, Georgie's dead, my dude. My point being, the killer has been dealt with. You've won. You really think I'm that stupid? I understand you have an obligation to bring me in. But Family's here, yeah. up a little. It's over. Punish so, him. Shall we get going? I'd rather not dawdle. All right, let's go. Hand over the gun. I think yeah, we have to kind of do what it says. It, if you don't mind. What do you say? Hey! I'm sure Miss I said Martin hand over the gun. Such a reliable pub. I understand why she... <laughs> Get wrecked. Told you I wasn't messing around. You're under arrest. You'll be given a trial in front of your peers. <clears throat> and your punishment will follow. <laughs> Why did we handcuff him in the front? That's what I want to know. Wolf went off. My last cigarette. <laughs> Chapter 4? I think there's only five chapters. That means we're almost done. Ugh. I know, I know. But we have to do something. Are you fucking kidding me? Witching well. Are you sure he's coming? Yes, you'll have an opportunity to... It's your boy. <gasps> Motherfucker. Are you okay? <laughs> no, do it's I look hours. okay? We were worried you'd run into some trouble. Don't I look okay? The crooked man's place. What? Don't I look okay? I guess you've been worse. You did well, Sheriff. I'm surprised. Not that you did well, but that, you know. I'm just glad you He's alive. One piece. It's snow. Time, it's the bib. Up. Throw this asshole down the fucking well. Yes. What are you I'm waiting for? Him down the you well. killed Lily. She was my sister. Oh, what you? do you have to say for Where yourself? the fuck do you get this off? You think you have the right and to just do this me? to people? You're a fucking crook. This. You should be fucking ashamed. Shithole. Everyone, can I have your attention? Ooh, Thank snow, you snow taking charge. Such short notice. I know normally we'd schedule a formal hearing, but considering the circumstances. I thought it best if we do this as soon as possible. The crooked man is charged with the murder as of I Faith and... As I already informed your sheriff, it was Mr. Georgie Porgy who killed those women, not me. What? It was Georgie? Georgie? You gave the order. I don't mean to interrupt you, Miss White. Georgie may have killed them, but you made the call. Do I have to explain the situation to you again? Wait a minute. So you're saying Georgie's the motherfucker who killed my sister? Well, where is he? Yeah, you're gonna bring that shithead in too, aren't you? 
Yeah, Sheriff. Where is he? Kids are running around to kill me. He wasn't behind it. Don't worry about it. He suffered up the end. For what he did. In the end, there was a fight, and he bled out from his wounds. It's lol. Lol. So he's dead? That's oh, what yeah. you're saying? I can't believe it was him. So you see, the culprit has been punished. There's no That doesn't need change this. anything. We'll deal with it later, but right now you're the one I'm concerned with. You called the shots. Georgie made that perfectly clear. In which case you still have a lot to answer for. I and was told I would be allowed to speak. We have to read the rest of the charges. What other charges. Let her finish. Then you Listen can have to your Snow. Say. Got it? If you insist. <clears throat> you are charged with the murder of Faith and Lily. Which Georgie carried out on your order, inciting violence Lol. against various members of the Fable Town community, including Tell the off, attempted Snow. murder of Sheriff Bigby Wolf. Twice. A misunderstanding. Aiding and providing no. monetary support for the forced prostitution at the Pudding and Pie. Additionally, Fun. you are charged with multiple counts of fraud, extortion, racketeering, and the illegal possession and sale of magical artifacts. And resisting arrest. That too. Oh. Yes. Now is there anything you would like to say? <laughs> I'm innocent. First of all, it was me. Nothing to do with Faith and Lily. So you can strike that one from your little record book. Bullshit! Second, like hell you did. Stop the charade. We know you're involved. Come on, it's obvious. Everyone Let him speak. just shut up for a minute. You wanted a chance to talk? Well, go ahead. What? We all know he's guilty. What the fuck does he need to speak for? The crooked man has Meanwhile, committed crimes against off. this government, and most importantly, its citizens. These charges, if proven, are enough to justify death, upon which your body will be committed to the witching Where ground. it fucking belongs! Oh, so right. let's get on but with it, we promised then. you a chance to defend yourself, and I won't rob you of that right. What the You're fuck? Really this is about talk? justice. If we're ever going to pull ourselves together and make something of this town, we have to start doing things correctly. No more snap judgments, no more secrets. We are going Lots to treat everyone judgment. fairly, even when they don't deserve it. Ooh, Snow laying down the law. This is ridiculous. He's you gonna pull some floor. shit now. Thank you, Miss White. You've all met Georgie. I don't have to tell you what kind of person he was. He was a total scoundrel. Lacking in any sort of moral fiber. I hired him as a favor to his family, you see. A promise kept to a dying mother. Meanwhile, I have to keep to your point or what? as I had to get out of here, Mom. For me, yes. But he was not acting on my behalf when he killed those women. It was his business. And for whatever reason, I'm sure only he could understand, he murdered two of his most faithful employees. I had nothing to do with it. This is such a You're full of it. That's not what Georgie said. You covered it up. It was only a matter of time before something like this happened. If you were so offended by it, why'd you cover it up then? If it had nothing to do with you and your shit, then why'd you try to protect him for so what long? Ooh, laying it in. I never made any attempt to hide Georgie's criminal activity from you. I learned of it myself for only fuck's recently. For sake. Any of you actually believe this bullshit? Holly, please. Tell them, Bigby. When you finally showed up at my door last night, wasn't I more than helpful? I answered your questions. I was willing to cooperate. What's oh, I was attacked. Yeah, and your goons attacked me. Did you forget that part? They get a bit carried away sometimes, it's true. Loyal to the end. They do it because they want to protect me. As I protected them. You understand wanting to protect... He just literally said he protected them. Well, You'd do anything. You might even give up an innocent man. Just to save someone. I really hope point. you're going somewhere with this. I see you want to cut right to the point. I can appreciate that. Let me explain this to you. My employees are just that, hired help. I see some of them are here among you. They are not my slaves. No. They are all free to make their own decisions, as Georgie was. What about Lily? She wasn't free. She wasn't given a choice. Do you really think she wanted that any of those girls wanted their lives like that? I'm sorry, of course they Holly. did. I'm sorry that your sister asked me for help, and I'm sorry that I decided against my better judgment to give her a distasteful job. Right, and you kept them in debt so they couldn't leave. Yeah, 
That too. That's what you did to us. How you kept us all you in forget line. it was not me who put you in that position. You all act like I'm some kind of tyrant. When your government abandoned you, left you poor and helpless, sniveling on street corners, I was there to look out for you. Yes, but... Wasn't I? We didn't abandon anyone. We've been trying to help them. Really? True. What about Archie Greenleaf? Her story is not uncommon. She left everything she had back in the homelands. Everything that matters, anyway. With nowhere else to turn, she came to True. me for help. And what did I do for you? You got my tree back. I got her tree back. And in turn, we used her magic to help poor Fables get glamours. Because I helped her, she was able to make a living, provide for herself. And what did they do? She wanted my tree destroyed, but Bigby refused. What? See? You were gonna burn her tree? Snow, why would you want that? Snow is true. Playing. Don't blame Snow, she had her reasons. Greenleaf was using her magic to help Crane and the Crooked Man. That's why Snow See? wanted your tree. See? I got you, Snow. Why. It wasn't her fault. You can lie to yourself, but you can't lie to me. You hated Crane, and you hated him for wanting to fuck you, and you being too soft to notice what he'd do to get it. It had nothing to do with a crooked man. We've made some mistakes. I've some. made some mistakes. But believe me, Welcome in the Iron Call of the Day. I want what's best True. for this town. And that may not always be clear right away. But Clutch I want you all to know that I care thing. deeply about all of you. And so does the sheriff. Yeah, Obviously, right. seeing how I got shot. I can't shot. promise you perfection. No one can. But I can promise to always have your best interests at heart. Maybe you haven't noticed, but we've been doing all this to protect you. We're trying to stop people like him. The True. crooked man's been exploiting you. I love how he's the crooked man. He's life. legit crooked. You would go to him for he's the help, tilted man. And he would take that weakness and add it to his strength. And if things didn't fall exactly his way, True, he did die. take these two away from us. He took Faith and Lily from us. And while we can never get them back, we can certainly punish who's responsible. They're right. A hey, beast, still my boy. Of him, even now. But you needn't be. His contamination of this town is over. And hey. those girls will have their justice. <laughs> Get wrecked. Very good. Very good. The sentiment is surely appreciated, Miss White. But it doesn't disguise the fact that these accusations are completely unfounded. The sheriff simply doesn't have a particle of evidence linking me to the- Georgie was working for you! Bigby got a confession that- A confession that... that nobody heard. Now, I'm no barrister, but I think such a statement would carry more weight if Bigby weren't the only one to whom Georgie spoke. Especially given Bigby's... history. What are you talking history. about? History? And what about your history? All you've done to this fucking town? What do you mean there's no evidence? Maybe, maybe he's... I mean, this doesn't feel right, how we're doing this. I just need... Of course it's right! This man tormented all of hey, you! Hey, we got us. Georgie Let killed him! make sure I understand you. Hey, if you need ready. <laughs> I'm responsible for what Georgie did, because he was working for me at the time, yes? Yes. Of course! Where are you going with this? If I'm to blame for Georgie's mistakes, Shouldn't Miss White be held accountable for Bigby's actions as well? Like what? How about the way he treated poor Tweedle D when he was in your custody? He was beaten <laughs> to anything while under your watch. Under my watch? Maybe he's right. Did you think we'd all just let that go? You can't be serious. He was a murder <laughs> suspect. And I needed answers. Besides, Crane was still deputy mayor when that happened. Right before you decided to kidnap him. It was for his own protection. Oh, you're right. Everything's about everybody else's protection. Sometimes it's hard to tell the difference. That's enough. So, you won't answer for your employee's behavior, but I must perish for This mine. is completely different. I we all... did not order those two girls dead. 
It simply never happened. Georgie killed Faith and Lily. End of story. They want to scapegoat me for their own tangled ends, but they refuse to answer for their own this crimes. This isn't right. Oh, please. This isn't the point. We'll deal with them after we deal with you. Everyone calm down. This isn't I the mean, reason why the privilege should be afforded to no. This is how it's always been. This is what I'm talking about. We lashed our ropes to this diseased world, and ever since, which one of us has been there for you? Who filled your lives with the promise of more? Who was me. there while they idly played in their towers, judging you, treating you as mindless children? And now, who has been there trying to get the people who destiny. cheated Without you? Me, yes, me and Snow. Who pay your rent when you're on the verge of eviction? Who will they live like the they're queen kings? So that's assistance. their problem, not ours. Who will protect you from the big bad wolf? Who will be Big the B, huh. Miss White. Oh. Excuse me, I, dear. I wanted to make sure I had the chance to say something. Why don't you take and a that moment be... to catch your breath? What's moment. she doing here? I'd like to... I, I need to say something. We're kind well, then go of ahead. Of, something. Uh, of course. Go, go right ahead. ahead. You probably don't remember me. I don't know why I was afraid to come My here. Dear, I don't Just know shut you... up. You enslaved Ooh. us for years. Let us hear stories about what you do. Told us we would lose everything if we stepped just oh. one toe out of line. And we couldn't say a word <laughs> about it because of these damn ribbons. But you know what? Oh. Now it's my turn to talk. How are you? Oh. I found Vivian's body. Did you kill her? Did he? Sheriff, this is highly she irregular. wanted you Be all freed. Quiet. Vivian killed herself. He might as well have. Vivian killed herself. Back at the pudding and pie. I'm sorry, um, I don't think Nerissa! My name is Nerissa. It's okay, my dear. It's going to be Nerissa. He ordered them dead. This fucker. Faith and Lily. That's a lie. I was in the goddamn room when he did it. Faith and Lily are dead because of you. The only two people who ever gave a damn about me. And now I can finally say you're an asshole. And this just confirms it. He made Georgie do it. It was always him. Georgie would have never done anything without his say so. Ever. Hey. You're going to take the word of us. Stupid... At least five other girls will back me up on this. We all heard you say it. Oh. Did you know? Looks like we found our evidence. She saw it firsthand. He's guilty. Good enough for me. Savage. Me too. So that's it, right? Calm down the witching well. Nah, that's too fucking easy for a crook like that. What do you mean? He's got to pay for what he did. Listen to yourselves. You're all rats fleeing from one sinking ship to the next. That face when your dog so keeps quick something as bad. onto whatever will keep your miserable lives afloat. This is how you want to repay all I've done for you. What? You take two people's lives away and now you want mercy? You're done you know, talking. What do you expect? I can't. I... Wait. I can always rip your <laughs> Just arms off first. Would you? <laughs> I would. Well done then. Now for your sentence. We don't have to become murderers. What are you talking about? He's guilty. I know that, but we don't have to kill anybody. We can imprison him. Lock him up forever, somewhere he can never hurt anyone again. How can we be sure he won't escape? I can help. We'll use magic. That's I assure not good you, enough. There will be more if he isn't Hasn't stopped. I don't care. So we get rid of him. Fair enough. Get him out of here. We can send him Everyone, away. listen up. Snow taking charge. Clearly, we're having trouble agreeing on a suitable punishment. So I think this we. This is going nowhere. Someone needs to make a decision. Who? I hope you aren't suggesting yourself. We should take a vote. Should have a vote. Make it democratic. Do you really think that's going to work? He's right. Nobody can agree on anything. What about Bigby? What about him? I am the law. Disappointed. He's the only official representative, really. He should be the judge. That makes sense to me. I guess it does. Okay. Fine. Are you sure? This isn't how it's... It's what the people want, Miss White. Okay, Mr. Wolf. It's hey. your call. It's no one. Just... Do what you think is right. I said the vote, so... Yes, Sheriff. 
do what you think is right. Teach him a fucking Rip lesson. his head off. No. So, what should we do? Cast your votes now. Snow wants, him, wants us to throw him down the well. I want to rip his head off. Everybody else wants him to get locked up. Or some people want us to lock him up. But Swift, what do you want? Do, 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 do. He was thinking. But I feel like lopping his head off is entertaining. Alright, that's what we do then. He has to die. We can lock him. Oh, Everyone, he's gonna go. I'm not this way. Oh, well, okay. Rip us. Oh. Gets wrecked. There you are. I hope you all remember this moment. Think of me. When you try to sleep, finish it, Sheriff. Bowl. Please, we can. You're going to miss me. No. <laughs> nope. <laughs> oh God. Rip, rip, rip. <gasps> Have to do this when there's no kids in the room. Have to do this when there's no kids in the room. Get wrecked. Savage. I don't think Snow liked that, but that was way more entertaining. For Lily and Faith. Fable Town is afraid yes. of the big bad wolf. Another one of Good. Race from the books. I did what I had to. Achievement. The north wind blows. Dude, Worth, now they're all gonna fear us, which is dope. One day later. Hey, Sheriff. Are you gonna come see the truck off? We're leaving for the farm in a few. Thought you might want to. I don't know. I'll be down in a minute. Okay. Great. Lol. <laughs> Fear me. This fucking line. Oh, uh, Mr. Wolf? Flycatcher left his keys. Listen, Snow, uh, can we talk? I, I wanted to... I'm, I'm sorry, Sheriff. I have to take care of this. We'll talk later, okay? I think I might have messed up. Good morning, Miss White. <sighs> You're late. I think we might have messed up. Someone's gonna see you, Colin. He just winks at us. He's like, eh, it's all right. Meanwhile, his cat is still trying to get him off. I 
I know, but it's no way. <laughs> Yellow brick road. Oh no. I'm going. Jesus. They're kicking Toad out. We only Sad. Have five minutes. They carry me for fuck's sake. I don't give a shit. You forgot these. Oh, thank you. It's uh, been pretty busy around here. How can you Holy see, shit. honestly? Nice fucking day. Shit. Just okay, so dramatic. Back, would you? It's just a farm. You don't have to be so dramatic about it. Wait, Sheriff Bigby. I have something. <laughs> it's clam. You know, he was up crying all night, poor kid. Can you give this to Miss White, please? Aww. Dad says there's no time to say goodbye, so if you could bring it to her. Yeah, sure. I couldn't take. Don't worry about it. Me. And I got she you. Said she liked that one the best. It's a yellow beetle. That's a big one. They're cool, cause when they're little, they have these pouches that squirt juice at you if you touch them. I'm sure she'll love it. She said That's it was funny. Pretty. We're about ready to head out. What's it like at the farm? I've heard ogres live there, and, and they <laughs> eat people in their sleep sometimes. God, I hope not. Do we have to go? I want to stay here. Well, we don't have a choice anymore. <laughs> Your dad broke dead. the rules, the rules. You're not allowed to stay in Fable Town without a glamour. <laughs> okay. Come on. It won't be so bad. Have you been there before? No. I'm, uh... Some of the animals aren't comfortable around wolves. So you wouldn't know, would you? We're all set. He'll be fine. Goodbye, TJ. Hey, Big B. Hey, man, we, we told him. Where's your friend, Colin? Where's a fucking pig? He must be missing. How should I know? I'm sorry. Saying goodbye. Grandmaster at Library unlocked all Book of Fables entries in episode 5. A. Hey. Now snow's cute and all, but hi. Hi. Marissa. E. Oh. Yeah. I guess I am. It's not easy to forget. I know it seems like I should be able to. It's just. It's okay. I think if we took off the ribbon, she would die. So. Listen, I, I came here because. I have to tell you something. What is it? I wonder if she's really the original. It's about what happened to Faith and Lily. I'm not sure where to start. It was her. <sighs> Faith, Lily, and I, we had this plan. We were gonna find a way it out. It was her. Leave the pudding and pie for good. But then Faith decided to get some leverage. She stole a picture of Crane and Lily together. The minute Faith stole that photo, we had dirt on one of the crooked man's allies. If he found out, I... I had no choice. You have to understand. You've seen how they kept us quiet in that place. Can you imagine <laughs> just the lengths me. they go just to silence someone who had physical evidence? Narissa, just tell me what happened. I freaked out, okay? I thought if I came clean to Georgie, he'd get the crooked man to leave us alone. We could just forget the whole thing. Maybe try again in a few years. You what? So I told him everything. And I begged for mercy for all of us. It was her. I didn't want anyone to die over a picture. So you sold them out. Lol. No. Yes. George Lol. promised he'd smooth things over with the crooked man. I mean, the crooked and man's then... dead anyway. Oh, God. <laughs> Lol. I don't know what happened, but that night at the club, Georgie came back and told me things had changed. 
He had to make an example of us. We had committed treason. And while okay, the two so it still was. We're sitting there as he was telling me this. Faith walked in, and I had to watch while Georgie. Wait. So Georgie told you all this? Not the crooked man. Back at the well, you said. I know what I said. But it wasn't the truth, was it? What does it matter? I know the crooked man did it. So what if it wasn't the whole truth? It was true enough. I guess. Uh, What's done is done. done. Yeah, I'm like a can. I know he ordered their deaths. I wasn't gonna let him get away with it because of a stupid technique. But she noticed it though. Especially after that night after Faith. I tried to warn Lily, but she wasn't with her scheduled appointment. So I did the only thing I could do. I I left Faith's head at your doorstep. Oh, you. it was you. I walked oh, her God. over here, and I left her. You were trying to get my attention. So you... you started all this. I just pointed you in the right direction. People like us get forgotten all the time. The crooked man was killed. <laughs> when we Plot twist, damn. Silence. And the world likes it that way. We just... fade. Like we never existed. I couldn't watch that happen to Faith or Lily. Nobody cares about us. Not really. I'm sorry, Narissa. I'm sorry that's what it took to get me to pay attention. It'll be different now. You'll make things right. You Dude, I hope know. so. I don't know. It seems like no matter what I do, it's just not enough for her or anyone. I just can't win with these people. I know it might feel that way, but... They need you, Bigby. Both of you. Oh, yeah, no duh. You two make a good team. The way you look out for each other, and look out for us. I don't really I don't know, know where we stand anymore. Things are true. Different. Huh. Things are always different. Look, Bigby. After everything you've done for us, maybe they don't want to admit it, but without you, none of this would have happened. You listened when no one else would. You knew when to show mercy, and you hey. brought justice to this town. Finally, <laughs> because you brought the crooked man in, everyone saw who he really was. So from where I'm standing, you did the right thing. You've been given someone believes in us. And I left faith at your doorstep because I knew if anyone stood a chance against the crooked man, it was you. I hope I've at least done some good here. You've changed this place. For <laughs> better a moth or worse, on the TV. <laughs> wouldn't be the same without you. She loves us. We know. You're not as bad as everyone says you are. Oh, <gasps> she does care. I need to tell you something. I have to tell you something. I feel like we've met before. You're trying to place me. You like my ribbon? Do you like it? Faith wore one too. Would hide her beauty so she could escape his kingdom. They used to call me the Little Mermaid. Did Dr. Swinehart ever get back to you about Faith? He said he wanted to run more tests. I hope you find what you're looking for. Go after her. I'll see you around. Ooh. Ooh. Is that how the game ends? What? No. Oh. Wow. Uh. Yeah, okay. Hey! Stop that. What were your last words? I hope we've done 12, 29%. So overall, I did pretty good. Pretty good. But special stats. <laughs> deceased. 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 Live. Hey! <sighs> Damn cat. Stop trying to get the moth, stupid. Jesus. Please, we just caught a moth. 
that was it. We didn't even get. Oh, uh, well. We definitely messed up then just because snow hates us. And now there's going to be a second one. So we hope. Continue this already. Pick up the graphic novel today. Continue. I don't know. That's kind of cool. Alright, well, that's the wolf among us. And children. Anyway, hope you guys enjoyed. I'm gonna go now just because it's a wee bit late and I actually have to download this so that way I can use a certain part of this later on. So, uh, yeah, hope you guys enjoyed. We are almost at 17k gamer score, too. So close. So close yet so far away, but it's a good game. I enjoy that a lot. If they make a second one, I will be playing that. So, yeah. Anyway, see you guys next time. Bye.